Welcome back guys, it's here, Next Gen RC. And today, I'm going to be showing you guys how to resolve uh, a Castle ESC issue. Um, I had this issue after a week that I installed it. Um, I'm running the Castle Sidewinder uh, sensor uh, with the ESC. I'm running 3S with the combo. And um, the issue, I'm going to teach you uh, how to fix the issue when it won't turn on. So the first thing you're going to want to do is find scissors or anything that can cut through wire. I personally use wire cutters. So, um, first thing, I already did this, but, um, cut the switch out. Doesn't matter how much you cut. You're gonna wanna cut a little bit more than what you need and, uh, put them together. And, uh, I called Castle up and they said that it wasn't a problem, that, um, it doesn't hurt the ESC. So that's all good, and um, let me show you the screw that it turned on. So basically, it's gonna turn on now just by plugging in the battery. You're not gonna have an on and off switch. And personally, I like that better because you can sometimes leave the car running and it's just gonna drain your battery. After you do that, like I said, you can solder it back on or put tape on it. And that's it, guys. And next time, I'll be doing a tutorial on how to make a DIY RC stand. See you guys. And see you next time.